The first thing we need to do is prepare our geometry to send into the top network. So let's dive into the building demolition geometry and find the low resolution fractured object, which is this file node in the middle. So first of all, I will connect a null node. I will change its color to black and call it out fractured geo. Now we can optionally connect a rest position. So remember, this node is not mandatory, but it may be useful in the future. So for now, let's leave it there. And now let's create an assemble node. And the important thing about this assemble is that we will create packed geometry, or in this case, packed fragment pieces. And notice how another property that it has on by default is this create name attribute. So here is something important. When we fractured this geometry with the RBD material fracture node, a name attribute was created. So let's go to the geometry spreadsheet and let's click here on primitives. You will notice we have this name attribute. So in this case, we have a concrete piece zero, piece one, etc. So since we already have this name created, we don't need a second name created here in the assemble node. So it's very important for us to turn this off. Same as the connect inside edges, we won't need it. We only need the packed geometry. So this is all we need before we send the geometry to the DOP network. So let's now create the DOP network. And you can do this inside the geometry node. It doesn't necessarily have to be in the object context. I just personally prefer the network to be in the same node just because it's easier to access. So type tab and then start typing DOP network. And what I usually like to do is color this node's orange and also change the name of the node to something that tells me what's happening. For example, DOP building demolition. Next, I will connect the assemble node to this first input of the DOP network. And now we can dive in the DOP network. So by default, we have this output node and I recommend you leave it here. What I'm going to do is first of all, add a gravity force. This will make the pieces fall down. Now I will add a merge node. I'm adding this merge and connecting it to the gravity because I will need several objects. First of all, the static objects it could be a ground plane, or in this case, I will use a terrain. But we will also have our rigid body dynamic pieces, in this case, the packed primitives, that will be colliding with the static objects. So let's build a static solver, connect it to the merge node, and we will also need a rigid body solver. So let's connect this second node to the merge. And although, as mentioned, I will use the terrain object as a final collision object, for now I will create just a ground plane. This will make calculations much faster and it will let us see how the pieces react with the impacts with the floor. So now that we have a rigid body solver, we will need an RBD packed object to bring our geometry into the DOP network. So connect the RBD packed object to the first input of the rigid body solver. Next, we need to tell the RBD packed object which geometry to bring in. In this case, it will be a SOP path. For now, type the following expression. Back tick, which is the key next to number one, then type op input path, open parentheses, open quotes, and type dot dot, close quotes, 
comma, zero, close quotes, and back tick, and then press enter. So what this function is saying is take whatever is connected to the first input of the current node. So this is our basic RBD setup. So let's press play and test how this looks. So notice how the pieces will start to fall under the effect of the gravity and also they will start colliding with the ground floor. So it's looking nice, although we still have a lot of work to do. Also the simulation for now is quite fast, which I like. Once we start adding constraint and more complex collisions, uh, the simulation will start getting slower. And in the end, of course, we will replace this geometry with the high resolution version. But as a starting point, it starts looking nice.